Hello Sagittarius, welcome to a bonus reading. This is going to be a reading all about what your person is thinking or feeling about you and what their next actions are going to be. As always, it's a general reading, so it will not resonate with every Sagittarius watching. So please take what resonates for you, what applies to you, um, and leave the rest. Or you can check out your playlist. There's a ton of videos there specifically for your sign. Uh, the playlist will be in the description box. So let's jump right in. Spirits, angels, guides, messages for Sagittarius regarding their person. What are their person thinking or feeling about Sagittarius? What can you tell us about this person Sagittarius is dealing with? What are their thoughts or feelings? towards Sagittarius okay I have lasting promise and walking away oh well someone could have walked away from a commitment here or is considering walking away uh, maybe they walked away from a family situation Someone could be walking away from something and heading towards a commitment as well. Let's see. We'll see when we uh, look at the tarot, what's going on there. Tell me more about what this person is thinking or feeling when it comes to Sagittarius. What are they thinking or feeling when it comes to Sagittarius? I'm working on myself. Can I get one more? Whoop. I'm taking action. I'm just going to take that top one. I'm ready to commit. Also, like, flipped up over here. So I'll take that one as well. So there, um, all of these, these first two anyway are action or, you know, they're not just like thinking, they're thinking about doing something or are actively doing something. So this person is working on themselves, taking some sort of action. So we'll see what that's all about. Spirit, tell us more. What is this person thinking or feeling when it comes to Sagittarius or this connection? What are they thinking or feeling? about Sagittarius or this connection. Wow, we start with the sun, okay? And we have the magician, yep, this is a doer. This is somebody that's trying to make something happen. What else? Oh wow, I'm gonna just take them all. Holy crap! <laughs> Okay, so we have the sun, the magician, and then these three came out at, together. King of coin, ten of coin, and two of cups. Wow. Bottom of the deck, eight of coin. So this is, I feel, what they're working on. They're working on maybe stepping into this king of, king of coin energy, long-term success, long-term stability, financial security, um... And this has to do with a partnership here. So what is with this sun? Maybe you make them very happy. Maybe they're happy around you, happy when they see you. Why is the sun here? Three of coin. Why is the sun here? Yeah, Queen of Cups. This person, um, there's love here. Uh, I have the star at the bottom of the deck. Aquarius energy. This Three of Coin, Magician energy. Uh, this is someone that's actively working on something. And then the Eight of Coin also that came out before that. Um, they're trying to make something happen. Like this is somebody who is motivated, has a wish, a desire, a hope. And it has something to do with you, Sagittarius. Tell me about the magician. Why is the magician here? I don't know if you work together with this person. 
page of wands. Yeah, this is about taking steps towards making something happen here with the page of wands. They're motivated. Okay, so the five of cups tells me that they're motivated by something from the past or motivated because they're missing something in their life. Wow, and then we have judgment. And then the three of swords at the bottom of the deck. So I don't know if there was something... Maybe this person walked away from you from the pa in the past or you walked away from them in the past and they might be wanting to regain what they've lost here with judgment. You know, I feel like this is someone that they have a lot of love for you, feelings here. Tell me about the Ten of Coin. You could be dealing with a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn or a fire sign. That's what I see so far. Tell me about the Ten of Coin. What's this about? Four of Cups. This person is not satisfied. I think they think about you and it's like it's, they can't even see anything else in front of them. Yeah, King of Wands. This is someone that I feel they're doing something with the with the way that they're feeling. So like if this is someone that is feeling regretful or remorseful or like they're missing something in their life, if they feel like, you know, nothing else interests them, nothing else matters, nothing else satisfies them, they're doing something about it. <laughs> they're not just going to sit back. Um, this King of Wands wants his Queen of Wands. She's at the bottom of the deck here. I feel like this might be you here. You're this Queen of Cups, Queen of Wands here. Someone that they are um, attracted to, desire. Can I get one more for the Judgment card with the Five of Cups? Can I get one more here for Judgment and the Five of Cups? Yeah, Ten of Wands. Yeah, this has not been easy for this person. They've been carrying this burden. I feel this is an emotional burden and they want to do something about it. They want to let this burden down and cut it out. I have the Ace of Swords and right behind that, the Fool and right behind that, the Eight of Pentacles. So I feel like this is what they're working on here, a new beginning for themselves, clearing out what whatever baggage is here, whatever's weighing them down, taking care of that. So let's see, what are their next actions going to be? What are their next actions going to be towards Sagittarius? What are their next actions going to be? towards Sagittarius. Oh, that one flipped. Well, we have the Queen of Swords. What are their next actions going to be? And the King of Swords. What are their next actions going to be towards Sagittarius? Ten of Wands and the Ace of Wands. Yeah, okay. So with the King of Swords, Queen of Swords, I mean, this is going to be out in the open. This is something that this person is going to communicate in some way. The King of Swords, Queen of Swords, they are very good communicators. They're interested in truth, clarity. Uh, emotions don't get in the way of their decision making. They're a bit cold or hard to read, but... That doesn't mean that they cannot communicate what they need to communicate, right? Now, this Ten of Wands is connected to this Ace of Wands, which tells me it's almost like there is an exchange that this person wants to make. So let's see. I'm going to put these two together because I feel like these are connected. Tell me more about this King of Swords, Queen of Swords energy. What's this King of Swords, Queen of Swords about, Spirit? The High Priestess. What's this King of Swords, Queen of Swords about? The Magician. Let me get one more. 
Tell me more about this King of Swords, Queen of Swords. This one wants to come out. The world, wow. <laughs> yeah, I feel like this is someone opening up in a way or bringing clarity to what hasn't probably been talked about because I have here the High Priestess. So it's almost like they want to clear the air or um, what's this phrase that I'm thinking of? It's almost like they want to straighten things out or set the record straight. That's the phrase. Okay, that's the phrase, guys. I just, I'm just telling you what I'm hearing. <laughs> And I feel like they also want to talk about what they want to do, which is, again, a whole new beginning here with the world. Bottom of the deck, I have the Emperor, Aries energy. It's almost like they want to tell you what they're going to do, what kind of action they're going to make, what they're going to manifest. If they need to tell you this for some reason, perhaps because you don't know. So what's this Ten of Wands, Ace of Wands about over here? Spirit, can you give us some clarity into this Ten of Wands, Ace of Wands, please? Wow, the Empress. The Emperor and the Empress is, have come out here. Tell me more about this Ten of Wands, Ace of Wands. What's this about? <laughs> There's the Emperor. <laughs> Just when I said it, he comes out. Okay, let me move this over a little bit. Yeah, this is about a divine partnership, your divine counterpart starting a new life, a new adventure together. But there has been an exchange. Tell me more about this Ten of Wands, Ace of Wands, please. Yep, Queen of Cups. This is about starting something new with the person they love, which is you. I mean, they have emotions here for you they have feelings for you and i feel like they need to prove to you what they're willing to let go of in order to have this with you six of coin at the bottom of the deck um so they're willing to i feel like the the feelings are mutual here i feel like you both feel the same about each other or you both want to give to each other um, behind that, I have the Seven of Swords and the Ace of Coins. So again, I just feel like this is someone who is going to do whatever it takes to make this happen. You know? And this I'm ready to commit. I feel like they are going to be in this for the long haul with you, or at least that's the goal. Uh, especially with the Emperor and the Empress. I mean, this is the couple to be. Like... They're the couple of the tarot, okay? So this is a very serious, and I feel like they're going to start with some serious communication first. Um, again, it's like there's, they want to set the record straight about what exactly they want with you. There's no BS here. This is not somebody that plays around with, you know, the king of queen, the king and queen of swords don't have that time, okay? <laughs> so that's what I have for you, Sagittarius. Let me know in the comments if this resonated for you. Um, if you enjoy the reading, please consider hitting the like button, subscribing. Uh, it helps the channel grow and it's a free way of supporting the channel. Thank you so much to everyone that takes the time out of their day to do that. All of the information about the decks that I use, my own decks that I design, my book or my personal readings is in the description box. And hopefully I will see you all in another video very soon. Take care.